Hi all, welcome back to the channel and for another trip. I'm just met here. So it's a historical drive today. We are going to Warangal. It's 250 kilometers from my hometown, Mahabubnagar. Uh, lots of historical places like Thousand Pillar Temple, Warangal Fort, and a beautiful lake as well nearby. I'll explain you. I'll give you the spots. So let's explore. Let's go. My setup for today. Slightly backpack. Okay, it's 250 kilometers for Warangal, showing four and a half hours for that. Let's hit. No riding gear, nothing this time. I'm driving free. This is our town over, which connects to Jetshala almost, uh, which is the hub place for Mangalore Highway. We need to continue straight on that highway. This road is done in recent. Climate is cold today, even it is sunny. It's cold, it's sunny actually. This mid road bar elevation is super, not with tall plants, not with small plants, exact size, just to cut off the opposite light. And for the new route, back to the old route. Superb artwork on this bridge, nice right? Okay, out of the town now, mostly. I'll play you directly in Jetshala because it's, uh, it's an old way, we've seen it already. Jetshala. Oh. This town is fresh, so because of this climate, nice. Likewise, the only highway here, NH44. It extends from Kashmir to Tamil Nadu. It's a big highway with overall length of 3500 kilometers. Coming to the trips, uh, I'll shuffle the places between long and short rides. This is how I plan. Need to give a break to the spine. This is Balnagar. Travel 40 kilometers till now. Round figure 200 to go more. That's why I'm telling. Tollway, no sign of sunlight still. It's 9.30 now. Garhadan Kuta. Fine. Even cloudy drive will be good. First tollway crossing. Uh, fine, I'll tell you. We will cross three tollways totally. Because I know this route. We are cross cutting Shadna now. We have to go left for this town. The exact middle spot. To Hyderabad, I mean, the way to Hyderabad. I think it's slightly rained here already. Water patches. In this type of traffic, always safety. Bikers lane. Confirmed, it rained here in recent. Yo, what a good. By the way, we'll get to see a big statue on our way. It's called the Statue of Equality of Saint Ramaraja. It comes after a cross country tour service road. We're almost here in the next place. We have to take a ride. It's Palmakula. In all the days, we need to enter the whole city and take an exit from Upal. That's the route to Warangal. Palmakula. Let's take a U-turn. We need to take a U-turn after this town. What is totally diverted? Okay, this is all because of this statue I told you earlier. The statue of equality. So it's a very big statue. In the very next month, this statue is going to be inaugurated by Modi. Oh, in this one way. So all this rush. So that gold one, 
that's the statue of equality uh, google it once with this name I want to give you a close shot but uh, I think this place will be restricted for now as PM is gonna visit soon let's give it a try let's see that's the entrance hatch uh, this area is vast actually super that's the statue I think it will be short for you because it's super view mode I got this no entry look at that at least we got this shot good for that break first break I don't bore I'll skip it up after the start starting again so it's more 150 km exactly on the side of the aura starting now Oh, Nice guy. He works in the short film system. Spoke well. Got to know my channel. Let's keep going. Hope it should not rain because it's completely cloudy. Look at that. Service road up to cut Kesar. Service road got to E2, 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 E2. Cross out of the Up to cut Kesar. Look, this map is asking me to change the route to the other side, right side of the aura. Pretty area left key. So this is the right. Here across the room, I think I left right. Okay, we are in cut case on now. Uh, I've skipped this whole service route. Most of you pitch to pitch a pain we got diversion scheme. So I have skipped it from here. It's 120 more. It's completely a heavy drive. Should be smooth and quick. This is National Highway 163 that extends from Hyderabad to Chhattisgarh. It's perfectly sunny now. It's good. For 120 kilometers, my brain is like, okay, 120. It's all because of this Goa ride. This distance is like pale dot for me now. The only diversion on this road is spot. The same signboard map. Indian Ramayan road at the time. It's a great right. Second tollway. Oh, police. Okay, fine. The most pleasing thing with me is this helmet. Helmet please system. Good view here. Yes. We are in Bongir outskirts, crossing it. I'll call you the town names because this have a cuts off all the mid towns up to Warangal. What have you of that hill right? For this shot, your view will be good than mine because you are seeing it in wide mode, super wide mode. Check out this highway once in Google, you'll find a railway truck falling all the way up to Orangal. I don't know what after that is, it's still falling on now, but up to our place. It should be like this, it will be like driving desert. We crossed Alair just now. We are crossing Jenningham now from the outskirts. In this route, this is the middle spot for Warangal, I mean Fireman Warangal, the exact center point. From here it's just 60 kilometers, that's it, showing one hour. Quick field break. 
problem with this V6 vehicles is it holds up 2 liters of fuel in its tank as a safety. You can't use it. So points will be gone. Like I said, two tollways, then third tollway crossing. But now it is someone really love it. We are crossing Kanpur now. It's more 30 kilometers from here. That's it. Karunapuram. Hanmukunda 19 over angle 25. Left. Oh, so there is a diversion. Diverted. Should take right under this bridge and make way to the other side. In GBS to Hanmukunda bus. Came to the other side, we are off the highway, we should be in this main road. We are here mostly, we are in Warangal outskirts. We all know that Warangal is a tri city, right? It's a mixture of three urban cities like Kasipet, Hanmakunda and Warangal. So right now I'll stop at Kasipet where my relatives stay. We are in Kasipet now, the first city in tri city. Junction here. I still here for 15 minutes. No, I'm going. Huge jump. I'm getting to my destination. After this, please, we need to take left and a two minutes drive. That's it. Non stop in aviation, charge west. So this junction I have to take left. This left I told you earlier. This is the second junction in Casper. So I drove 240 kilometers till now. It took three and a half hours for me. I started at 9.30 in the morning and I reached at 1 in the afternoon. Three and a half hours. I reached my destination. So this is the vlog for today. I'll vlog tomorrow. I'll set things and get to Warangal Fort and Thousand Pillar Temple. So, see you tomorrow. Hi, I'm Susmit. It's the next day. Think it has day two. I'm staying in my ladies home. So, we are going to start from here. It's Warangal for our first day trip. So, it's 15 kilometers from here, showing half an hour for that. It's like, let's do it. Let's go. Okay, let's go. It's fourth time. Hey, fourth vlog after long gap in our channel, right? That to Akdiya's fourth. Fifteen kilometers. Let's hit straight. Nice broad roads here. It's a two-way Broadway. Uh, this place, Midbar, is good with nice plants, perfectly planted and poured. I know it already, but telling you. Break. Okay. You know, I think this Warangal Fort is a World Heritage Site concluded by UNESCO. Also submitted by Delegation Department of India. There is one more big circle in this town. Our aspects here, we have to take right from here. Here is a tiny zoo called Karthia Zoological Park. I know it, I wasted it already. In maps, this place is showing as revenue colony and also a track is following beside us, which is right. Okay, we need to get under this bridge and cross to the other side, to the right. Okay. Now, colorful tunnel. Okay. 
night. Stop, stop.